Welcome back to Let's Play Final Fantasy IX. You're going to enter the village of Question Mark. Continuing on with the storyline. Active time events. Alright, oh, treasure chest, gotta love that. 
Yes, I needed an antidote right now. And a potion. Oh my god, that's terrible. Okay, we got a letter for this guy. Let me send you a letter. You don't like him, though. save. Now, we'll notice that uh, daggers won't really give us the reason why she wants to run away from home, but there does seem, seem like she's pretty serious about going and doing it. Uh, I mean, this, this could very well just be, like, the kind of just out, uh, sort of um, overreaction of what is quite literally a spoiled princess. But unless she tells us what's going on, we're not really going to know. She wants to blend in. I mean, <laughs> guys, terrible at his job. She wants to blend in now. I um, mean, whether she's doing that well enough or not, well, she's clearly not. <laughs> Well, it seems as though maybe our princess isn't flying as far under the radar as she thinks she is. Still sound funny, though.
Oh, God. What do you got, kid? Okay, we got the weapons that we could have... Oh, we already have most of these. And I can get the two leather wrists. Of... Oh, feather hat. Nice. Buying expensive stuff. Burning all that money that I had in my pocket. Gotta remember, she has spent her entire life... I mean, I don't know how often she actually managed to ever leave the castle, but... She's been, um... She's only really had exposure to the outside world through books she's mentioned. So, you know, you can't really blame her too much for having a rather uh, poor understanding about the way people communicate or how they act in social situations. Um, sell these off so I don't... Um, don't uh, have them sitting in my pocket all the time. Broadswords, we don't need those, right? I have a lot of broadswords for some reason. That's the first time we really had access to a village in this game. Oh, we can see the... Oh, there she is. That's creepy as hell. <laughs> All right, are you looking through the mirror, the window? Are you looking through the window, or are you just like peering through a hole in the ground or something? Either way, dude, seriously, knock it off. Weird. Okay, Mayor Guy, with a weird name. Remember Zidane, Vivi's like seven. You know, that Moogle is there, hearing every damn thing you say. <laughs> Just standing in the corner, even staring at you as you're talking. Why is there a chocobo in the well? That shit doesn't make any sense. That's a mill. A guard for what? Why were you bothering to tell me that crap? Who am I for you to bother telling me that? Oh, I thought there was a treasure chest. Ah, I can't get to that yet. Ah, whatever. It's 
This goes in the mayor's house, I think. You're busy standing in a hole in the center of your living room. Can't get that way. Mayor's key. Hmm. Aries. Another shop, I think. Yeah. Yes, I need medicine. I want nothing that you have. You're terrible. Okay. Out this way is that little farm that Dagger was hanging around at. And a big hole in the ground. Uh, I think, yeah, you go that way, you'll leave the village. This was the first village that we really had a chance to run around in, in this game, and visit shops and stuff. Aside from, like, Alexandria, which doesn't really count because you didn't have any money or anything like that. Steiner's not even here. 